My first day at South Point was more so I had been going through a lot of family issues and um, some issues with my health and personal issues, battles that I had been facing as a child, um, different obstacles in my life that I couldn't get past, um, trying to forgive. And one night I just had to give it to God and ask for help and I knew that that was that was a sign for me to get up and start church. Um, this right here is my heart, chosen family. Um, she has walked through many obstacles in my life with me and I wanted to share this moment with her and I wanted her to feel what I felt when I left South Point that morning. So I called her and said, please, it's time for us to go. We both need help, and we both have to do it together. And we have been going since. The night before, I really had some struggles because uh, about three days prior, my dad had a heart attack, and it was the first time I had ever seen my dad um, in that shape. And he's the only parent I have left, which is a battle for me anyway. So I don't know, it kind of just came to me that day, like I have been battling with severe depression and anxiety and getting through things that have happened to me throughout my life and trying not to be so angry and just I just want to live again and I don't want to live moment to moment anymore I actually want to live I want to feel again and something about my dad's heart attack just made me realize how important it is for me to get that much closer to God. So it was like perfect timing. So when she brought it up, I was like, please, okay, I'm gonna do it today. Can I do it today? And she was so, so excited for us that she put us both on board to do it. And it was the most, I can't even explain the feeling. Like ever since I got baptized, I feel like I'm so close to God and like I can actually do this. that water when I came back up my life was changed forever I felt it 